some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we have a frauditor who's absolutely destroyed by the average citizen. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Nice shot right there. Are you an auditor? Huh? Are you an auditor? What's that? Well, it's one of the people that go around videotaping private citizens. Oh, really? Yeah. Are you an auditor? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Okay. Can you, can you get me? What what purpose do you serve? What purpose do I serve? Yeah. Just going they about say my it's day. a First Amendment thing, but why don't you go to places that will, like biker bars, um, go to places like drug where drug addicts hang out places that when they're record when you're recording them they're going to do something to you why do you take advantage of this public sit or private citizens take advantage of yeah. private citizens yeah i know this is your first amendment right um actually this is a very big thing to meet you because i've always wanted to ask somebody like you why you think this is important well if i Wait. was an auditor like you described being a First Amendment, right? It's all about freedom, probably. Well, this isn't about freedom. Why not? Why, why is it? Well, because why harass people that are just going about their day? Why not actually do something important? Like go go well, get from, somebody that's breaking the law. Go record somebody that's breaking the law. Why not do that? From my perspective. Why not take the risk of doing that? From my perspective, you're the one that approached me and are harassing me. I did. Me. No, no, I approached you. I, would, I just want to know what you're doing. No, I want to know what you're doing. I want to know what you're doing. Well, you can wonder. You're welcome yeah, to no, wonder. I, I can wonder. What's the matter, frauditor? Cat got your tongue? This citizen wants to know why you do what you do. Now would be a good time to educate. Now would be a good time for you to do what you've always wanted to do. Show the public what you're all about. Or that you're just too embarrassed to admit that you're a First Amendment auditor and ha realize that you have nothing to contribute to the world at all. Don't worry, it's okay, you can admit it. We all understand. Sure. And I've seen I've seen your kind online. Sure. But I wanna why I wanna know why you don't do it and do something that is that is of importance. Go go get somebody that's breaking the law. Go go audit somebody like that. Why wouldn't you wanna do that? You won't answer that? What would happen if somebody followed you home and audited you out in front of your house? and then posted it online and said, this is where an auditor lives. What would you do then? Well, first of all, if someone came onto my property, that no, would not be on your property, not on go. your property, on the sidewalk, well, like there you, you guys go. do. If, okay, if, so if what if would you do? If someone's standing on a public sidewalk, they're fully within their rights they to do They are within their rights, yeah. so what would you do if, if, if somebody followed you home, stood out on the sidewalk and started harassing your neighbors, and said, well, hey, look. If someone was harassing my neighbors, that's for my neighbors to deal with. Well, it is for your neighbors <laughs> to deal with, but I'm sure it's your neighbors, I'm sure your neighbors would love, I'm sure your neighbors would love to deal with this. I'm sure your neighbors would love to uh, have uh, somebody stand out in front and then know that their neighbor is causing the problems. Well, let me ask you, am I at anyone's house right now? It doesn't make any difference. Sure sidewalks aside, no, no, it doesn't. Sidewalks aside. Well, you're making an analogy if I was in front of someone's house or I'm not making an analogy. I'm saying it's pro it's, I'm it's not in public front of anyone's property. House. It's public property. There you go. So if I, stood out, if I stood out in front of your house on the sidewalk or even on the parking strip, this grass right here is public property. Public easement, yeah. And if I stood on it in front of your house and recorded you and recorded your neighbors and uh, in, in this type of manner, just standing there minding my own business, mm -hmm. what do you think your neighbors would do? Or think about you? Think about me or yeah, the think person about holding you. a camera? Think about you. I really don't You're care the one. Think okay. about me. <laughs> All right, very good. Yeah. Well, I look forward to uh, um, seeing this online and I look forward to finding out where you live. Oh. And I look forward to... Okay. The auditor's finally getting audited. Oh, okay. Well, you serve if you no got purpose. a camera phone, you're welcome to pull it out. No, and I'm not going to pull it out now. I'll wait until I'll wait until you take off. Okay. Uh, we'll see if we can arrange to follow you home. I'm good with that. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice. Well, yeah. You're not going to see where I live. <laughs> no, we'll we'll see, man. Yeah, we'll, we'll I think see. I think it's about time the auditors get audited. There we go. Let's see how they like it, and then we'll. There but we I I'm all for you. Uh, and I'll make doing... sure I get your license plate get there. My, get my license plate. That's fine. Since you're the one that offered to follow me home. There we go. No front plate, by the way, huh? Huh? No front plate, by the way, huh? No, no front plate. No? Isn't that illegal in California, or do you have an exemption for that? I probably have an exemption. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, okay. 
All right, have a good uh, have a good day. Look forward to seeing you again. Yeah, we'll see. No, no, we won't see. Well, we know. Oh, okay. There Always you go. look forward to the auditors being audited. Well, then you're welcome to follow me if that's what you want to do. Let's let's see what happens when the tide turns. You guys think that you're so uh, uh, big, and you think that you're proving a point. You're not proving any point. Go out and do something. Go out and do something important. Go out and catch a bad guy. Well, this is all your opinion, right? No. No, yeah. I've, I've been online. I've seen it. Go out and catch a bad there we guy. Go. go out and do something important instead of thinking you're exercising your First Amendment rights. Oh, it is my First Amendment right then because we'll I can I can disseminate this to whoever I want. Disseminate it to whoever you want. There we go. It's a shame that you uh, have an issue with people's freedom. Uh, if this is how you exercise your freedom, then that's the shame. This is not exercising freedom. This is just harassing normal everyday people. Harassing? Again, you're the one that approached me, buddy. Harassing everyday people. <laughs> you're the one that approached no me. No reason to record regular people going about their daily business. You're the, the one who approached me. You know what this is? This is. You, you have a good day. Nobody will come after you. You have a good day. Oh my goodness, I think the assistant just broke the frauditor. Please stand by while we correct these technical difficulties. He's like a chatty Kathy. <laughs> Well, I'm going back to my business. Here, let me translate from frauditor to normal person. I need my safe space. I need my mommy. The nasty man said something to me. I gotta run away. Of course, that's just a loose interpretation of it. <laughs> no, no, I'm good. I see these guys on Have a good lunch. Later. Have a good lunch. <laughs> so we got Mr. Opinion here, and he's welcome to his opinions. There we go. Audit the auditor. There we go. There's the new one. Audit the auditor. There we go. There's a channel called that, by the anybody, way. Anybody that sees this, follow an auditor home. Oh, there we go. There you go. There you go. All right, auditor, take care. Bye, sweetheart. You know what? You know, you know what's funny, auditor? You weren't even willing to say you were an auditor. There you go, sweetheart. That's how courageous you are. Ooh, First Amendment right. Courageous. There it is. We got a triggered Darren over there. Bye, Darren. <laughs> Bye, bye Darren. He's right, you know. You didn't even have the courage to say that you're a First Amendment auditor. Most of the people I watch as far as First Amendment auditors will take that to the grave with them. They're only too happy to tell you that. You are a coward. It's funny how he was uh, adamant about catching the bad guys. Well, the last time I checked, that's for law enforcement to do is to catch the bad guys. Took you a while to figure out a comeback. Too bad he left already, but then again, he probably have made sure that you would have needed some butthurt cream. Now let's listen to the rest of his pathetic little ranting. My job is to uh, go out and document freely, when and where I want, and I'm here to catch those who violate my rights and your rights when it comes to public photography. Oh, right, well that was interesting. We got a triggered uh, Darren over there. He was very opinionated, said what he wanted to say, and I let him have his uh, free speech there. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up from Union, yes, Federal Credit Union. Ah, don't you just love the frauditor's revisionist history? Such a beautiful lie.